guys, it's Jasmine. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm planning in my classic horizontal happy planner um, for the week of February 18th through the 24th. So um, I'm using the Gold Star Quotes book, the 1486 piece sticker book. And then I also brought out this fitness book because I do plan on um, doing some workouts this week and kind of focusing on fitness after um, eating all of that chocolate from Valentine's Day. But I actually don't use that book at all during this spread. Um, it might be something that I'll kind of get to um, as the week progresses. So I decided to pull out the Gold Star Quote books just specifically for these two um, stickers. I just, I felt like this was a week where, you know, I would just really think about how hard it is to be an adult. And I know that sounds kind of like, uh, I don't know, first world problem-ish, but um, adulting is hard, y'all. I just don't, I mean, if I could go back, I gladly wouldn't. I think it also, um, I think also the fact that I do work with children um, on a day-to-day -day basis makes me, um, I think, appreciate <laughs> the uh, whole um you know, childhoodness of it all, you know, and just like naivety that you have when you're a kid and you're just like, oh, I just want to grow up. And oh my gosh, if only I could go back and redo those years. But anyway, I just decided to cluster a bunch of really nice quote boxes and quotes about um, the, you know, adulting. <laughs> I also pulled out this um, sticker, the circle sticker from the, uh, sticker book I think what is it 1400 1486 stickers in the book uh because I wanted to continue on with this like kind of black and tealy aqua -y green blue look um and I actually don't stick with just this um kind of greeny blue color I also pull in some other ones that I find throughout the books that I'm using so right now I'm looking for maybe just something else to cluster up there. I really like this whole idea of clustering stickers to um, really, I guess, bring some um, creativity to the planner, you know. So I find this uh, just quote sticker that says, wake up and be happy. And I thought it was perfect right there. I also cut down that circle sticker. I don't know if you can tell, but I cut it down so that I could, um, so that it wasn't just hanging off the page. Now I'm trying to decide where to place my um, kind of focus box for Monday, Tuesday or, you know, for the week. So I decide to um, actually pair it with another box. So I'll have kind of one for Monday into Tuesday and then one for Tuesday. It just works out and those will probably just highlight the main things I want to get done on those days so that um, all the other to-dos that will be jot down on those pages um, don't overshadow it because that's that happens a lot where like I'll write something you know a list of things to do down and completely forget about how I need to prioritize one single thing so here I bring in some more of the um, different color I guess green blue combination stickers I like these little um, strip stickers that they have throughout the books and this one says be brave be bold be you just a reminder um, to you know push through the week and just be authentic and myself so I pull out another of the strips to bring some black and white to the other side of the spread because I wanted to and you could see I was kind of comparing the two pages I just wanted to make sure that I was continuing kind of the color scheme throughout. I had no idea when I started this um, <laughs> this layout what it was going to end up with. I just knew I wanted those two um, kind of adulting stickers and then this is where it led to. So now I believe I'm looking for um, more stickers to cluster on this page and to um, kind of bring in some of that, uh, some of that, I don't know exactly what color, because like it Looks like almost a minty green, but it's not that light. So, I don't know, the green blue color that I'm bringing in. Um, I l wanted to add some of those like ribbon stickers, but then I was like, no, I didn't really accomplish anything. But I thought I could easily bring in this clear you did it sticker um, as a symbol of, you know, 
me making it through the week. So I want to, and I want to layer it. So I just pull up the other sticker. I love that you can easily pull these stickers up and just lay them back down. I'm going to pull up the other sticker and I layer it underneath. Here I'm trying to, you know, just add some more color in that area. Um, I thought about adding like some dots for confetti, but I thought that would be too much. So I just put this heart and I actually layer it on top of the clear sticker um, to bring some color to that sticker exactly. And then I'm going to be looking for um, more ways to do my focus for the end of the week. So I find this don't forget and then another to do box that I can layer. Um, and I'm trying to decide exactly where I want to put this. I know I want to put it kind of Friday, Saturday, especially because those days are going to be hectic. So um, the to-do box goes down on Friday and then the don't forget box. I don't want to leave a lot of kind of awkward space between the circles and this box. So I do pull up the so busy circle a little bit and kind of layer it under the box because like I said, that space I probably won't write in unless absolutely necessary. And I didn't want to leave just some awkward blank space over there. I wanted to make sure that I had enough usable space to write lists for things that I need to accomplish this week. I have these, I think I got these tweezers from, um, uh, Michael's or Joann's. Um, and I love how pointy they are cause they will just like slip right under a sticker, um, and pull it up. And then that's where I put down that dot that had just been sticky on my hand <laughs> because I had to get rid of it. Um, and I wanted to straighten out the sticker a little bit, which I don't know that I did ultimately. Um, but maybe I did because it looks like I pulled it up more than I thought that I had pulled it up. And I'm also kind of pulling it closer to um, the circles as well. Now I'm trying to figure out, I'm going to try to figure out what to do to the bottom I think of that um, page so I do find this new day same goals clear um, sticker I love these uh, kind of just word stickers as well to add um, a little bit of motivation to the week and so I just put that in the middle of Sunday because even though Sunday is going to be a new day it will be the same goal of accomplishing all of the stuff and I love this quote it says um, so I think it says so I figured out that being adult is just, you know, just means that you just Google, you know, things to figure out how to do them or something like that. Uh, but that I think is hilarious. And I could use tons and tons of these stickers because that is exactly what being an adult is. You just Google stuff. Like today, I just Googled how to quickly chill wine because I went to the grocery store and picked up a bottle of wine and I knew I wanted to have it with dinner. And yeah, <laughs> I figured it out. Here I'm trying to figure out if I could use washi to cover up that bottom um, kind of notes box because I really didn't know what I wanted to put there. But um, ultimately I do change my mind. I pull out a couple washi to see if maybe it'll work out, but I just decide against it. Um, and instead I end up, I think, covering up um, some of that space and like relabeling it for other purposes. This one uh, is another of those adulting stickers and it just says, I'm done adulting, let's be mermaids. So obviously the theme of the week is like, let's be done with adulting. <laughs> or at least like adulting is hard because it is. <laughs> um, so here I'm looking for something to um, add a little bit more black and white. And so I decide actually to use these polka dots um, to cover up, like I said, that those headers there are over um, the bottom box so that I can find other labels for them instead of there being like a word of the week in notes. I think I end up just wanting these to be, um, you know, kind of priority list areas. So um, I can't remember exactly what stickers I pulled out. One was just like, you know, get done, you know, get this mess done. And the other one, I think it says like top priority so that, you know, whatever my one priority is for the week, I can make sure that I put it down. Oh, that's right. The taking care of business because I kept looking at the sticker wanting to use it. And so that's what I label um, the left side with this um, downward pointing like banner that says taking care of business. And then I find um, another downward pointing banner. For the other side that says priority or top priority and I like these banners a lot 
I think they're really helpful for covering up things like that. Um, or you could like use them to cover up the dates if you um, want to. I was like, why am I struggling to put down this banner? <laughs> but that's the end of my plan with me. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know if you have any questions down below. And I will see you in the next video. All right. Bye.